when Stephen failed to summit Mount Everest, he discovered a new definition of success. So I made the choice based on being the leader and talking to my team to turn around and to end the Seven Summits snowboarding quest right then. And I had some incredible turns coming down the north face of Mount Everest. And it was also, you know, for a long time, really bittersweet. I, I felt like a failure, even though I got to snowboard on the north face of Mount Everest, even though I knew I made the right decision because an avalanche came down the following day and wiped out the whole face. We would have surely been killed as a team. But I still had this feeling in my gut that I was a failure for several years. And I don't know exactly what it was, but it was a mental shift where I just realized that was the best decision I've ever made in my life. I saved my life and the lives of my team. And it's not the traditional barometer of success to turn around, but to me it's the new barometer of success to know when to, to settle, to know when to compromise, to know when to turn around and change focus. The first question people were asking is, are you going to go back? You know, when are you going to go back? You have a track record here, three of the previous seven you failed on and you went back to until you succeeded. When are you going back to Everest? And I said to them, you know, I'm not going back to Everest. I tried it. I'm done with the seven summits. I am complete with this goal. It is time to change directions. It is time to let this one go. If I went back the dangerous hard way again, I think I would have probably died. And if I went the easy way with all the people and the fixed ropes, that would have gone against my values to do that. That would have been for the wrong reasons to go only for glory or only to tick it off. And I do things because they're important to me internally, because they touch my heart. That's why I climb mountains. That's why I connect with people. It's because it feels good and it feels like the right thing to do and it jibes with my values. So I didn't want to compromise those. And it's not the normal form of, of success, you know, turning around on a mountain and ending it. But really it is, it's the new form of success insofar as following my heart and having it lead me to you here today.